Alright, so this is a video which I will be using on my phone because a lot of people have been asking me in streams and just in DMs about how I have like this overlay of a crosshair thing which just stays in, in place. So basically, um, I will give the link to the download in the description. This is capable on Mac and Windows. I think it's also capable on Linux, but um, yes, yeah, so basically you're going to want to open the link which is in the description it will bring you to this page so then you just see it's cross cross over that's the name of the application cross your overlay because it overlays your screen then um nope so basically you have a bunch of uh download here so it's available for linux uh, windows and mac so i i i'll obviously download this because i'm on mac I'm pretty sure all of you are on PC, so I'm pretty sure you would buy one of these four. And yes, yeah, so basically when you download it, <coughs> uh, let me just do that. I mean, I already have it, so it'll open up your just like your Finder. Uh, go to Applications, and yeah, as soon as you open it, just open it. I guess, and it'll bring up this thing. It might not be <coughs> in your in the middle of your screen. That's the only complicated, it's not really complicated at all, but um, maybe some of you would think it is. So basically to open and close it's option, control, shift, x. For, with this you can drag it wherever you want in the screen, you might want to hear there, I don't know why, but um, keep it wherever you like it most. So for me, it's obviously we're going to keep it in the middle, and then, oh god, yeah, this, it just glitches sometimes when or on an application which is moving in the yeah, let me just yeah. so basically you can choose your cross your color this is like the default like for scoping and stuff this is animated to change the color you just click it you can change the size of it if you want a larger you can have there's all sorts of kinds there like it's, it's a lot of kinds and here we go I'll just give a scroll through of all of these I, I personally like one of these or just one of these dots. In the middle. That's what I or I I sometimes use these, but that was a long time ago. So yeah, the as you can see there are a range of varieties of these crosshairs. They're pretty sick. And um, yeah, there are a lot. I also used this before. It helps. Then there are more kinds, some some special requests that people wanted. Yeah, this uh, it, it's, it's okay. I don't know why that's even a thing, but uh, this looks pretty. Uh, that's like right. so. Yeah, there are like a lot. People may want to like the X. That's how some people like it. Yeah, those are all the range of crosses which are available right now. More may come soon. I'll just give it a quick scroll through again in case you see anything. And yeah, that is that. So I personally use this one. What is it? I currently use cyan. So to close it, it says right here. So hopefully you don't forget it. Uh, you can have a special site on this to, and then wait, no, what about what? You can change. Okay, let me actually move this so you can see it. So as you can see, there's a yellow thing, you can just click the color, change it to like blue or something, then it'll be there. But you don't need to have it on, you can have it as a plus instead, or just off as I have it. But, um, I actually, it might be on nice. Okay, now I'm, I'm going to keep it as how I like it. Then you just click it and change color, whatever. You can have the opacity if you don't want it that standing, like, out, just change it. To I use it at max because I want to see it clear, and then the size that depends on how large you actually want it. So for me, just place it in the middle of the screen. That may be, hopefully, it's not too difficult for you people. But okay, just, then you just uh, I, it just that looks like it's in the middle, doesn't it? Yeah, it, it's pretty simple. And then why am I? I always click that. Okay, then just adjust the size. I like keeping it when the big like dots on the side are just like at the edge of the 
Now, say for, for that, that's how I like mine. That's for this crosshair, that is. And yeah, just keep moving. Run around. Yeah, this may bug your mouse. Wait, let me try now. Yeah, you can't move if you try this the first time. I don't know why. But um, if you if you rejoin, so I uh, guess go here. You know, I just rejoin. Loading up. Then just it doesn't matter. Just wait a bit. Alright, we're joining. So as you can see, it is in place. Um, and also, if you guys are wondering if you have to move it every time into the middle, every time you open it, that is not true. Let me just set it on like that. Alright, and then you spawn in, as you can see, it's exactly in the middle of your placement. Yeah, this helps because of, like, imagine if I'm in, like, a dark map, like, street corner, right? And then, you, you have your black crosshair, right? So you, you can't really see that much. But then you got this overlay, you can have it whatever color you like. I personally like it at sign, because I like a dark and bright color. So I can like use either one for either side. So then basically, it's, it's very dark, right? You, you can't really see the black pot, you, see, you can't see it at all. But you can see your extra crosshair, which is exactly in the middle. So just aim. Yeah, so you know where the center of it is, it's right in the center of the crosshair, obviously. And yeah, it, it, it's very simple. It's just like just like, download and open and just change. So it's basically just like three, four steps to do this. So just, just download it, open it for whatever version you want it Mac, Linux, whatever. Then just change the crosshair color you want to whatever color. Change the actual crosses whether you want know, like mines or like a scope or like an X cross or thing. There are many different like varieties of them. So yeah, I highly recommend trying this if you are struggling with problems like that. Or just in, in general, like so you can see like the spread outcome and just still have uh, a good like mind like a good mindset of where the actual center of your screen is. So just so you aim like there to their head and yeah that's about it for this video oh, i hope this actually helps you out and yeah i'll see you guys in my next video or stream have a great have a good day peace out and goodbye